A Lehigh chocolate shop has issued an apology and changed the names of some of its items after a viral Twitter posted complaints of racism. Fox 13 News reporter Spencer Joseph joins us live from Utah County tonight after speaking with the shop owner, Spencer. Good evening. The item in question was actually a chocolate covered Twinkie and it was named two different things depending on what type of chocolate was used. If it was milk chocolate, it was named the Hill Camora Nephite and if it was dark chocolate, it was named the Hill Camora Laminite. Now a little bit of history for our viewers. The Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints says the Book of Mormon recounts the history of two peoples, including the Nephites and the Lamanites, who lived in almost constant religious and political confi conflict for centuries and said the term Nephite and Lamanite came to describe cultural and religious distinctions as well as ethnic differences. Now today's conflict started from a Twitter post that spread to comments on all social media, including on this store's Yelp page with lots of different people giving one star reviews over the names. Now John, the owner, said that they took down the name, which they've actually had for about four years around noon today and issued an apology on their Instagram, saying in part, I deeply apologize and commit to being more sensitive about the message of our chocolate. Now, I spoke with him this afternoon in his store in Lehigh where the name had been changed to just Hill Camora for both types of chocolate, and he told me it was never his intention to hurt anyone by those names. We had the name, this particular name has been here for four years, and uh, we had one other complaint about it three years ago. I like to have fun. I don't want to poke fun. I want to have fun. Uh, I don't want to <clears throat> minimize anybody's suffering or hurt when you know better you'll do better you know we found out we we found out better now he also said that they've received lots of calls and messages today most of which were very aggressive and used foul language against him and his store some of them were even threatening the store and himself because of this. Now, by the way, he says that he will in the future be more cognizant of the names he gives his chocolate, all of which are named something different and something uh, with a play on some of the members of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints, some of the high-ranking members, plays on their name, plays on Utah things, as well as plays on names of celebrities. In Utah County, Spencer Joseph, Fox 13 News, Utah.